and not too far in Kenya, scientists believe they have discovered a new way to combat malaria. As VOA's Faith Lapidus reports, a common medication already used to treat a host of illnesses makes people's blood poisonous to the Anopheles mosquito, which spreads the deadly disease. Malaria remains one of the world's most stubborn health challenges, infecting more than 200 million people every year and killing about half a million, most of them children in Africa. The disease spreads when a mosquito bites someone already infected, sucks up blood and parasites, and then bites another person. Scientists working with the U.S. Centers for Disease Control and the Kenya Medical Research Institute believe they may have found a new way to prevent the spread of malaria in small communities. It's a drug called ivermectin. For a long time it's been used to, uh, as, a, as a prescription medicine for treatment of, of intestinal worms, mostly in uh, children and even in adults. And in parts of West Africa, it's actually been used for control of uh, the river blindness disease, what we call onchocerciasis. So what we found out was that the moment somebody takes ivermectin, if a mosquito bites them, they actually become poisonous to that mosquito. To be effective, researchers say the medicine needs to be distributed in a controlled and calculated way throughout a community. So ideally, how you ivermectin would be given in what's called a mass drug administration. So if we select a community, a village, for example, or, or a county, for example, everybody in that county receives the drug at the same time. So it means that for that period of time, for the, for the, for the 28 days that ivermectin is effective, um, you'd have a continuous killing effect. So everybody that a mosquito comes and bites at that time, would be actually, that mosquito would actually die. That would be good news for the millions of people infected with malaria every year. I'm Faith Lapidus, VOA News. And that's our health report for today.